Hello everyone, today's video is yet another Drawing Your OCs video. This is uh, the third one, I think. And, um, yeah, I did only three. I, so you see, a, you see a fourth sketch and like the little thing up at the top. Um, yeah, I did not finish it because uh, I wanted to get this video out and I didn't have any other videos like completely finished. So I thought um, I could do this one. Um, so yeah, we'll get right into the video because this is one of my smaller videos. So this first one is Sunbeam, really cute. Uh, let's see here. Sunbeam is a sandwing rainwing dragonette. Her mother is a rainwing and her father is a sandwing. This person doesn't have much of their backstory, but here's what she has. Sunbeam lives in the rainforest with her mother. Even though she is only three, she loves to help gather fruit for everyone. Her father lives in the sand kingdom and is one of Queen Thorn's advisors. Sunbeam's mom can only take her to visit her dad a few times a year, so she misses him during the t her time in the rainforest. Uh, this person kind of based Sunbeam off a lot on Kinkachu's personality uh, because they wanted her to be cheerful and an overall happy dragonette. Even though Sunbeam misses her father and she tries to stay positive, she always and always finds things to cheer herself up, like her wonderful Rainwing friends that don't mind her different appearance at all. Uh, yeah, that's that's her little backstory, or I guess, like, thing. I love her color palette, like the oranges, the yellow, and then a little hint of green. Really cute. Um, what's funny is that I literally have a Rainwing, Sandwing OC named Sunbeam. Um, yeah. It's real funny. I know. What a coincidence. Uh, but yeah, I'm really happy with how this drawing turned out. And I like her little playful pose. Um, she looks like she's ready to play, and I really like that. Next character, we have Chive. It's not up yet. I'm sorry. I'm waiting for it to come up. <laughs> I refuse to make a script for this video because I'm too lazy. Um, so yeah. I'm just winging it. But this is Chive. Um, the first one, the, f okay, so the first video that I, OC video that I did, they had, um, Komodo, the Sandwing, that OC. Yep, the same person emailed this character, but it's their friend's, uh, character. Uh, let's see here. So, there's no backstory currently, but, yeah, it's Chive, full leafling, I believe. And I really like it. She's really pretty. I didn't know exactly, like, or, like, because I don't know what, like, face expression to go with, because in this bottom picture, she's, like, smiling, like, like, almost, like, grinning eagerly, and then, like, top one, she's smiling, uh, so I didn't know what to go with, so she's smiling, like, uh, like, almost, I, I don't know, I'm not good at explaining things, I'm sorry, guys, the colors are very dark, and it, like, is such a contrast compared to Sunbeam's colors, um, I had fun drawing this character. She was really fun to draw. Wow, I really like it. I realized I drew all girl dragons in this video. There was going to be a fourth one. I promise I will get to that one in the next video, but yeah. <laughs> um, I just, I couldn't finish it in this video, but I tried to give it under, like, lighting, um, like, here you see me doing the shadows underneath instead of like in front and I like doing that okay this next one is coffee I don't know if there's a backstory but she was um someone tagged me on YouTube for it uh yeah so I love the little um everyone's art style and like their pictures they're so pretty I love everyone's art style this one's like really cute I like how she's like putting her hands together her little talons together like this um I totally didn't draw the side of her face with the scar. I was looking at a reference for a dragon pose and it was facing that way. And then I was like, no, I wanted to add the scar, but <laughs> I I didn't, I don't know. I just didn't think of it at that time. I really like her color palette. It's like yellow, greens, and blues. That's uh, almost the color palette that I like to go with a lot of times. That's like my default color palette. Um, it's really funny. 
Um, but then there's like a little bit of pink and it's really cute. I really like this character. It's just fun to color. Um, and I believe, I believe she's a Silkwing Rainwing. Uh, <laughs> don't quote me on that. I have to pull it up though, so. No idea. Okay, okay. Oh, she's a Silkwing Rainwing Seawing. Right, I forgot. She's got the seawing frill thing, or whatever they're called. Um, yeah, she's blind in the eye with the scar, and she's normally quiet. Really cute. It's um, really cute, Dragonette. I, I actually really like this uh, character. I had trouble doing the circles, or the sh things, or like the little bubbles around the hearts. That was hard for me. For no reason. I don't know. It was really hard and I don't know why <laughs> no idea it was I couldn't get like a perfect circle it was annoying um I'm I, I'm pretty proud on how this turned out it was it was okay drawing yeah um I think your OC is very cute um but yeah that's all the OCs that I colored <laughs> And so, yeah, um, that's the end of this video. I hope you guys liked these drawings. And, um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Y'all have an amazing rest of your day. Reality will never be good enough. And even if it was, we just mess it up. Cause we already